Hey there, Smudgies. So we've been digging deep into the blocky world of Minecraft lately. It's easy to see why it's such a popular choice, you know, with its endless possibilities, quirky mobs, and the satisfying pop when you mine a block of diamond. But today we're going to switch gears. We're going to look at the flip side of the coin and answer the question, is Minecraft overrated? So get your pickaxes ready. We're about to mine some controversial territory. All right. But now, don't start typing your hate comments just yet. Hear me out. The game definitely has its charms. I mean, who doesn't love spending countless hours building a masterpiece of a house only for a creeper to waltz up and turn it into a fireworks display? That's high-quality entertainment right there. Now, the first issue I have is with single-player mode. So, you remember the good old days when you'd be playing a game alone, but you'd never really be alone? You had computer players for company? They might not have been the brightest or the best, but at least they didn't ditch you to go play Fortnite. Minecraft, in comparison, can sometimes feel like a lonely island, especially if you don't have friends ready for co-op, or the time to organize a Minecraft multiplayer extravaganza. I mean, what if I want to build a massive castle and I don't have 10 friends on standby? An AI crew would really extend the game's shelf life and make it accessible to even more players. Think about all the folks out in the gaming community that have families, maybe they have friends that don't game. This would make it more accessible to a lot more people. Right, remember those classic games where even when you were playing alone, you never really felt alone. The computer players kept you company, and let's be honest, you know, oftentimes they ended up being the butt of the jokes. But in Minecraft, when you're alone, you're really alone. It's just you, a vast world, and the eerie sounds of... Ooh. So the thing is, not everyone has a buddy on standby for a co-op game, and organizing a whole squad for online multiplayer can be more complex than solving a Rubik's Cube blindfolded. So why not throw in some more AI companions into the single player mode? They could help you with tasks, join in on your crazy construction projects, or just be there so you can pretend you're leading an epic expedition, right? This addition would not only bring back that old school feeling, but would also make the game more accessible, and it would definitely extend the shelf life of Minecraft and open new doors to people who prefer a solo adventure with a little bit of a company. And let's talk about building the thrill of placing your first block, building your first rudimentary shelter, but after your hundredth block, it starts feeling a little bit like, uh, well, it feels like work. And I didn't sign up to be a construction worker. I signed up to fight zombies and discover some hidden treasures. So, I think it's time we had some auto-building features, like hiring workers, or maybe even getting those cute little blocky pigs to do some labor for us. Or hey, how about a blueprint system, where we sketch out our castle and then watch as our character, or even better, a team of AI minions, bring it to life. Now, that's a Minecraft that I can get behind. They added this feature in the new Minecraft game. It would be nice to have that in the original format as well. And lastly, let's go ahead and discuss the mobs. So sure, they're quirky, some of them are cute, and even some are very terrifying at sometimes. But don't you feel like there's room for more? And I'm not just talking about different shapes or colors. I mean, we've got skeletons, spiders, zombies, and those, those exploding greening guys. I mean, come on, where, where's the creativity? Where are the fantasy creatures, the mythical beasts, or even some aliens? And let's just not stick to just scaring us. How about some friendly creatures, like a, a loyal dog that just doesn't sit there but actually helps you out, or a magical sprite that helps you find rare materials? Variety, my friends, is the spice of life, and I think Minecraft's menu needs a little bit more seasoning. So there you have it, folks, the three reasons why I think Minecraft might be a little bit overrated. But hey, don't take my word for it. Dive into the comment section let me know your thoughts, especially if you're a diehard fan and you're ready to defend the honor of your beloved game. I will be here ready for a friendly debate. And remember, folks...